that one line here then towards this is the head hmm? the head so I'll move the other line towards the head come back to the channel again today we are in the fish farm again to continue from where we stopped on our last video on the work of induced breeding of african cat fish and the last video we made mention on injecting them theoretically but today we are going to be doing those work practically and mind you this is night and we are doing this at night you know on the last video we made mention on doing it at night because at night we are having a stable temperature and it is good for them to have a stable temperature when doing this fluctuating temperature is a very bad temperature for them and so in order to get maximum ovulation in your process you need to do this at night and here are the two female brooders that we are going to be injecting this night let them see it and each of these female brood brooders weigh two two kg let them see the second one And so guys, I really want you guys to learn things from this. And that is why we are doing it practically. We are going to be injecting them today, this night. So stay tuned and watch this video to the end as we are going to be meeting our hashi manager, Brother Israel. <music> Israel, the hash free manager, is going to be in charge of what we are going to be doing this night. He's going to be the one to inject the fish. So, thank you, sir, for being here. Uh, thank you very much, man. Uh, and thank you again. Yeah, thank you, sir. And uh, it's a good privilege. Yeah. We are honored, sir. And anyone that see what you do or what you do as um, something bad, it's a privilege. I choose to neglect what I know. Yeah. But, uh, I think that uh, God will place value on the little we do in the name of Jesus. Amen. So tonight, um, in our last episode, we talked about uh, those breed of cancer fish, and uh, we discussed that uh, without uh, much particle. So tonight, we are going to be injecting the female Buddhas that will be using for this uh, particular. Uh, in this project. So the first thing or the first thing in your this building is to induce or inject the female breeders to be used for the um, experiments. So follow us as we see it practically and we learn better by seeing the way it's done tonight. Come this way. So let's go. Here is the female coach. So, last year, we have to learn the practices that are not to catch the fish in the river or the water. To always um, target your aspect to attack from the head, not the head, to attack from the head. You see? You see? You see? So, if you attack from the head, Yes, yes, yes. We are This means that you that All your. Come on, the face. Come on, the face. So, we, we cover the face to, to help must get the fish to be still. Once their face is covered, they become stable for you to walk with them. So you learn this, then you are doing your, your own in this business. So let's go. So now we are going to an injecting platform where we put our fish and we will get. Okay. There is a platform. Seem to cover the piece so that the fish will not drag or fight. So, now that I told us in our last episode, give us 
the the dose the dose of the dose of the ovulation is taken by the body weights of the fish that is you weigh the fish both fish weigh two two kg now we are going to take one meal of the blade because the fish weighed uh, weighed um, three kg to get the expected uh, outcome all right okay so but i like i told us in our last episode that um, we inject the fish above the lateral line towards the head at angle of 55 degrees so you see how the angle is placed you see the position of the lateral line thank you so i will teach you this this paper help us to control the base of back flow the back flow is the flow back of the movement so now here what should we see here is the lateral line the lateral line is the line that runs through the mid center of the fish you might not see physically but with your hand you can feel can feel it see here is here can feel it hmm? can, can you can feel it hmm? can feel it can feel it so you place your needle and put that to that one line here then towards this the head hmm? the head so I move the other line towards the head you know they are put so they are so is there so you put can see my hand at angle 55 degrees so this back flow see back flow this is done to reduce the level of back flow okay in other words you can also you can also share the dose also share the dose as well put put half here also put half uh, at the other side you can also put the total dose in this place so whatever we want to can share your dose have those have those to still be okay hmm? just be okay but meanwhile after after injection you keep your fish apart to the pond mind you i told you this pond we call them holding pond any pond you need to you hold your fish so the second female we are using two today first female is here Okay, so to touch from from the front, yes, from here. Okay, so nice, 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 nice. Ah, very good. How are you? How are you? How are you? How are you? Are you pleased? Yeah. How to utilize all the, the blame for the two fish. So if anyone left, will be shared for them. This is done to have always wasted. Okay.
Now, I told us before, we inject um, above the lateral line towards the head at angle of 45 degrees, yeah. like we did earlier. So, and I said, you use your hand to feel that arm. You feel it, you feel it, you feel it, you feel it. Yeah. And then this is towards the head. Towards the head. Get me my tissue. See if you have one. That's towards the head. So, towards the head. That's our line. Towards the head. Mm -hmm. Towards the head. At angle of what? To five degrees. So, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This angle is 90, this is 45. Right? Mm -hmm. So, you give, you give, you give. Slowly, when you rush it, the level of back flow will be very high. So, you give, you give like this, like this one in the mm -hmm. so, Massage. This is done to reduce the level of back flow. So, after this, the back flow is very high. Get more tissue again. Yeah. And avoid um, blood coming out. Don't allow the, the needle to touch the gill to avoid blood coming out. So make sure you know the needle should not over penetrate. Okay. So, so, like, how many inches will the needle penetrate inside? Um, uh, there was a scientific. Uh, measurement for it, you know, actually the, 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 the needle enters the, the, the most, you know. Yeah. Then, you know, this injection we have is, is muscular injection. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We have muscular, we have um, uh, 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 abdominal, so another vein, vein so yeah. part of um, the other name. But any injection you give animal or man being mm -hmm. uh, on the muscle, is a muscular injection. Okay. So guys, I hope you are really getting a lot of information from I'm this. I'm doing this now to reduce the level of back from back flow. Back flow. Back, okay. Yes, if the back flow is high, to reduce the the, the dosage. Yeah. High. Yeah. 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 Take mention on that. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Last yes. 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 Yeah. Because before I told you before, um, the do the dosage is calculated by the body by weight. By the body weight. Yes. So yes. One kg zero point five. Two kg one mil. So by the time the back flow is much and have the Reduction in the reduce it. Yeah. Though the fish might ovulate, but uh, will not give us optimal ovulation. Yeah. And carcass also have optimal ovulation. Yeah. So I think right now we think have stopped the after. so we can take the fish back to the holding point. The fish is covered. So the fish back to the holding point. And in my yeah. But why do we separate the fish from each other? Yes, yes. So, yes, we do that because to avoid them fighting. Okay, yes. So we put them together, they will fight. Yes, they will fight and they will enjoy each other. Yeah. So that's Trouble like that disturb yeah. fighting also affects the relation. Yeah. Now they don't want they don't want noise. Okay. Yes. When we're in school, uh we're taught that noise is a pollution. <laughs> yes, yeah. And when upper level then. Yeah. So uh, before then I, I never knew that yeah. <laughs> noise is a pollution. Yeah. Yeah. So at this uh, at this stage now, yeah. Yeah, you're making noise now, then the pollution has it. It's affected. Okay. I know fish reacts to pollution. Yeah. So pollution go beyond you adding an uh, impurity. So even the noise you're making now, so it's affecting me. So don't make noise. So they need to stay calm. Yeah. The... Because of why? The noise is a pollution. It's a pollution. That's the why. <laughs> Thank you. So um, we are done injecting. So now we wait for eight hours. So this time, this night, right? Yes, sir. Nine. nine. So from now now to six, guys, right, just count eight eight hours from now. You come back for your stripping, and I said before, like now, the is cool, yeah. So, we might have to reduce the duration, yeah. Yeah, so the duration at which they will let my reduce, yeah. 
know, earlier I know in our last episode I told them they will have high temperature. The temperature will let faster. The level is faster. Yeah. They have a low temperature. So, and yeah. today, the weather is not too so, so it's very cold, so we have a delay in ovulation. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Or, whichever way, we'll be here exactly in hours to check because if you're not here in hours, you, you, you come, you meet all your eggs in the water, and yeah. that will be wasted. Yeah. So, because if you don't come when you're ready set to be, to be strict, yeah. you'll meet your egg in the water. So, thanks, thanks for watching. and. I pray for you, God, God bless you. And then I say, it's part of going to um, fish farming, or not just farming alone, like the scientists like us <laughs> in, this, uh, in this field. God will empower you and guide you, and God will bless the work of your hand. So, Amen. stay tuned. Tomorrow morning, we'll be here to, to see. And what is being equal, you'll be here with me also. You, you'll see how um, and the brothers will be stripped of their egg. And how the mute will be missed with the egg, and how the egg will be incubated. God bless you. Thank you very much. Sir. Thank you. Very much. So, guys, I hope you've learned some lessons from this video. This is Farmers Hub. We are here to make sure that you learn everything concerning fish farming. And like I said before, this is episode by episode. So we are done with this evening episode. Tomorrow is the next episode which is stripping and incubating of the egg we got from the fridge. So if you like this video, hit the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification right away. See you in the next episode. Bye.